Greetings everybody in the Sabre community. This is Denzel Wong here uh, sharing another one of my builds that I completed a couple years ago. Uh, it's been sitting on my shelf and I thought I'd do a video of it. This is a uh, Corbanth NW3 that I had picked up a while back, sat in a box like all my builds do. Eventually, after a couple years, I got around to installing it. And, and now, I mean, a couple years after that, I'm getting around to recording a video for everybody. So, to, like to show this a little bit, it's a standard install. There's nothing, no crystal chamber, nothing too exciting about it. Although it does present its own unique challenges when you do these very compact builds. Um, it's just not a lot of room in here. Hats off to those who have done crystal chambers and reveals in this because it's a feat. But uh, it's got an 18650 battery, a Nina Biscotti version 2, I think, 20mm um, speaker. I did some uh, additional modifications. I bored this uh, out to be 7 8 inch blade. Made my own um, blade plug out of brass and, and polycarbonate. Or is that Delrin? I don't recall. Um, standoff in brass. Vented. Kill key out of brass. This is not a dual worthy saber. It's just the construction. There's things that are glued together and I mean yeah, this part here is kind of wonk, wonky. It's not threaded. You have to glue this piece on. So I wouldn't duel with it. But it's a nice showpiece. Uh, not accurate, as we all know nowadays. We have 89 Sabres version, which is beautiful. I have one of those sitting in a box. needs to install. But it's got a lead engine up in the front. Copper heat sink underneath here. And a hidden button right there. <coughs> underneath the... Uh, faux leather here. I replaced the plastic one and I machined a whole new piece that goes here and then um, put the faux leather. It feels a lot nicer than that hard plastic funky stuff. So. And I'll show you the, the blade in it really quickly here. Now I've been considering selling this. I haven't decided yet but we'll see how my 89 Sabres comes out, I might, if that 89 Sabres wouldn't do, if I like it better, I'll probably sell this one. That retention screw is tied then back down. Kind of looks pink, doesn't it? But it is purple. Now this is mixed with LEDs, or LEDs, the LEDs mixed with resistors. That was a bit of experimentation to try to get the right resistor. Well, there you go. My Corbanth NW3 basic installs with a few goodies. Let me know if you like it. Um, I might put it up for sale, depending on the interest. Until next time, thanks for watching.